What's going on guys? Coach Jack here again, Cornex Fitness and you know I want to talk to you guys about some you know a little motivational tool on just things that I, that has been coming up in my head throughout the whole day and you know the thing I want to talk about is what drives you you know for each workout, what motivates you, what inspires you you know to keep going each day and then you know what are your shortcomings that you know stops you because a lot of these things are the ones that goes through each person's head. So you know, so uh, so here we go. So I'm just gonna talk to you guys about um, you know how I motivate myself for you know these workouts for each day. And I'm almost done with this P90X2 journey, and it's just it's been a fun journey so far. But you know, it's not about me, but it's about you guys. So here it is. You know, what pumps you up? what gets you driven, you know, what gives you that focus to, you know, to, you know, find that goal that you want to do for that day. The thing is that, you know, when you're given like these programs, like 90 days, 60 days, 30 days, don't look at the numbers, but look at for each day that you're going through, because those days are just numbers, you know, people might think 90 days is too damn too long for fucking three months, but uh, just go through the journey, like, as it was that you're doing as your everyday lifestyle. Because you know, it's a, the, oh, these journeys are lifestyle changes, you know, not just because you're changing. Uh, like I want to look, I want to look nice and and you know, sexy and all this nice stuff. It's not about vanity, but it's all about mental. It's all about uh, your mental strength. It's all about your uh, your spirit that drives you. And lastly, is your body, because um, how do I say this? Because you know, if you left it up to your body then it's not gonna it's not gonna work for some reason and it's all here because if you left it here it's your it's uh, it was yourself that pushed play so how to find the excitement in you know these workouts you know a lot of the things a lot of times that we see these things that you know it's structured you know this way let's say for example we take V-Skull from Pinatix 2 it's like we take the workout as it is well then what drives me to do it every single week is that I make it more challenging for myself and that um, like maybe for like one week I'll add strips at curls at the end that's what drives me because you know I'd say it's coming up the week and then you see that oh my gosh you know V-Sculpt's coming up and um, what can you do to change this around to make it like to make it have like that, that game changer face to, to put your game face on because I'm ready for this workout you know so like for me, you know, adding those trip sets at the, at, towards the end just, just makes it more like uh, exciting because um, you look up for it. You you see that it's coming and you, you want to do it even more. Another way is the type of music that you listen to because for me, the videos that I do uh, are all, uh, majority of it's Christian rock and uh, I, my, my uh, playlists have changed and it's been like Fireflight and Flyleaf and a lot of the lyrics in the songs just makes you want to like, you know, go down to your knees and tell me, Lord, just take all of me right now and then just give me the strength that I need for these workouts. You know, it's all mental. It's just the things that you that you put towards yourself and, you know, um, it's the drive from those lyrics that just makes you want to like, you know, scream out loud and then uh, especially doing like, like pull-ups or whatever, even rep-wise like curls or just shoulder presses and you're screaming out like trying to push those last reps and you see that you hear the lyrics saying um you know uh spread out your open arms and you know let go of everything also you know defining anger is another key motivational tool like what tony hart mentioned define anger right now you know find the anger towards the workout not towards your family or your friends or even your cats your neighbor your dog um because when you define anger in your in the thing you push yourself to the limits and you realize that after the workout you feel so much better because uh, you worked really hard and you you know the pain that you had to undergo you know, to feel that pleasure, to feel that good feeling afterwards, all the rush of endorphins in your head um, and that's how I feel it because you know each day for me I really need to work out I mean, you know, different types of workouts doesn't it doesn't have to be like all straight resistance days because you know you could um, you could hurt hurt yourself. 
So there's various types of different exercises um, to work the brain, to have the, the immense drug parts in your brain, like the endorphins, your adrenaline rush, and everything else like that. Because, uh, you know, for example, like me, like when exams are coming up, and you know, I get really stressed out, and especially when studying comes along, I need to, you know, work out before studying because you know I feel so much better when I'm ready. When I'm ready, uh, when I finish the workout, and I get into the studying, my brain is like open up for all the information that needs to you know get absorbed into there. So it really does work, um, especially for like exams. Like before the exams, I'll probably do like you know a stretching routine or a yoga routine or something else like that to uh, you know to calm the body because you know when you go in there when you're like you're all hyped up and ready to go your body becomes nervous and the blood is rushing and you can't, you can't really concentrate that much so when the body is calm it's thinking um, it's thinking is straight for it's straight on it's not rushing it's it's uh, it's calm and it's ready to you know look at the information and see how it's uh, written how it's worded and you know you take things on the calm way but if you're rushing and you're like ha, 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 I'm ready for this you know you could something you could mess up so take things slow here so that's about it I mean like literally everyone has their own types of motivational tools you know some people have to have like a major major beat down for themselves you know to you know once they break down and then they realize all their faults all their wrongdoings you know they get back up stronger than they were before and you know that's what we have to do sometimes because like whether we're not always perfect we're not always here you know we have a roller coasters sometimes during exams like if you don't do so well and you get your results and it just bums you out throughout the whole day you you realize that i'm not going to do anything for today i'm just going to go sleep and you know, do it do things like that or just like get you out of your commitments for the day like that's when you define your anger you know you really you you take your workout and then you examine that test, you examine that exam, whatever that was, and then you just fight it in you, fight it mentally, and then fight it with your body to, you know, feel the pain in a good way. So, um, there we go. So, here it is. Just want to get you guys pumped up for whatever workout you're going to be having for today, whatever this video is going to come up, and, you know, just be excited. Find, you know, that's why it's also, you know, I mention mean, this all the time, but it's called Corex Fitness because, you know, you, you see a sun before, a star, like you see it there, and that, that star is your is your car, and then once it explodes, that's when, um, that's all the energy that rushes inside you, just, just imagine, just imagine that car, that, um, that sun inside you, that star is gonna blow up, and then once that star blows up, all the potential is already released, everything is, you know, is uh, put out for you, and that's when you bring it X-like, because you know you found you found, you, uh, you found the fuck you already found the focus you already found what was your purpose you already found your goals that's when you go on and you you know bring it hardcore style hardcore style x style so that was it guys coach jack your game with car x fitness and that's like some motivational words you know don't make excuses just keep going just keep pressing play you know, it is hard every day, but just find something that'll, you know, drive you, something that'll motivate you, something that'll make you just jump up and down, something that'll, you know, realize that, you know, I'm here, I'm gonna go for it. This is gonna, you know, I'm gonna feel good afterwards. If I don't do it, I'm just gonna feel like crap afterwards. So, that was it. See you guys later. You know, bring an X2 like. See you guys soon. Go deeper, dig deep, bring it. All the motivational words are there. It's up for you to take it. Now, if you don't want to take my advice, then that's fine. So, here we go. I'm Coach Jack signing out. Car X Fitness. See you guys later. It's always about working hard. And you can do anything you put your mind to. Trust and believe what I'm saying. Working out is not just about the act of moving. It's about the focus, the mental focus you put into yourself. The only reason why you push play today is because your mind told you that you had to do this. If it left it up to your body, you probably wouldn't have. So you focus, you stay in there and go.